Holy smokes, guys. Check that out. That's got to be one of the fanciest Dollar Trees I've ever seen. <laughs> this was actually an old Surefine grocery store, which closed up a handful of years ago, actually. Uh, probably well before 2018, as a matter of fact, when the place was up for lease. But now it's a Dollar Tree, and it's been a Dollar Tree for a number of years. And that's really cool. I want to go check that one out. So let's go in there and see what they have for Easter, because it is Easter time. And we'll do a brief walk through the store real quick as well. So let's go. That is one fancy looking store. I like that. <laughs> all righty. Wow, what a main entrance. Look at all the summer goodies too. Actually, I need to get new pots for my plants too. So that works out. Oh, here we go, lots of Easter stuff. Okay, Easter ribbon. Lots of Easter ribbon. Decorative mesh. They got Easter baskets. They always have lots of Easter eggs. They have marshmallow scented Easter grass from Peeps. That's very interesting. Look at all the spring decorations too. Easter decorations. More Easter basket grass. They have all different colors and patterns. Lots of baskets. Coloring cups. More eggs. I like these shiny ones here. Oh, headbands. More headbands. Look, they even got the fluffy cottontail butts on them. <laughs> Very cool. Look at these large egg bowls here. Oh, they're containers. That's really cool. Wow. Look at all the Easter candy here. Double crisp, Easter eggs, cookies and cream. Even though it's Palmer, I'm not the biggest fan of Palmer. Peanut butter cups, they're okay, I guess. Not my favorite. They got spring solar lights. Oh, look at that with the butterflies. That's cool as heck. They run on AA batteries. Bunnies and chick and eggs or marshmallow candy. What do they have here? Peanut butter eggs. Happy hoppers. Easter candy. More. Look at all those happy bunnies. I'll take you on a little walk through the store here in a moment, but I want to show you all the Easter goodies here since I haven't done an Easter video yet and we're getting close to the day. So let's go see what they have. They have tons of Easter basket buckets here. All kinds of basket fillers, bubbles, more Easter eggs. How many do you get in here? It looks like a bunch. 24. Wow. They're smaller, but and they have holes in them so you can string them and hang them up if you want to. Very good. Lots of choices. Oh, look at that. I would love to get that in my Easter basket. Scotch tape. You know how much good that would do for me? Yeah. Oh, look at these. I have these in a piece that I made last year, or the year before. I like the ones with the speckles on it. They even have larger ones too. Very cool. All right, check this out. They have drizzled popcorn cake batter from Cold Stone Creamery. Lollipop rings, that actually kind of sounds good. That I'm not gonna lie, that sounds good. I might grab a bag of that. Um, I got the felt bunny garland with pom-pom tails. I got that hanging up at home. This one looks bigger than the set that I have though. Like it's nicer than the one I got a couple years ago. They have these little these little garden decorations that you can paint. I would think the weather might hurt that. They might be okay for plants that you put inside. Little wind chimes. Kind of little knickknacks. Look at these little gar or, uh, tinsel decorations here with the eggs in them. Oh look at that. I didn't even notice that. The egg garland. That's cool. Yeah, very cool. This bunny looks scary. I'm just going to say that now. <laughs> wow. Look at all these uh, containers here. The eggs are footballs, soccer balls, basketballs. They even have a baseball. And, you know, an egg-shaped baseball and soccer ball. Okay. All right. Oh, they got Play-Doh. Uh, carrot picks. All kinds of artsy decorations here. Pom poms, decor. The little, their little bunny butts. <laughs> I see this in the Easter stuff, and I'm, it's just comical. You have the thing for the rake, and then the handle you have to buy separately. But I guess that makes sense because it would be really cheap if you got a dollar rake. But when you put them together, it gives me a pretty brilliant idea to make myself look like a fool in front of everybody. I'm done. <laughs>
All right, moving along, they have s'mores bunnies. See, again, they're from Palmer, though, which is that cheap candy company, and their candy and chocolate just isn't my favorite. Maybe you like it, and that's great. I would want to try that, though. A s'mores bunny? Could be good. Could be. In this aisle, we have the girlsy Easter basket fillers. Little little tiny fillers that what are these color ups glow little posters with markers very cool on this side they got all the candy all the candy starburst jelly beans i have a lot starburst just the regular ones and peeps cotton candy marshmallow flavor what's this one back here it's the same just a different color Yeah, they have a lot of candy. I've shown that to you before. Easter dots, as opposed to regular ones. What's this? Warheads Chewy Bunnies. I just zoned that for you. Look at this, Rice Krispies Easter Bunny. Now that I want. I want to try that. They even have a Fruity Pebbles one right next to it. Back on this side of the aisle here are more Easter basket fillers, little treat bags with ties, centos, markers, pens, whatever, glitter potty, dart shooters. What else do we have? Ankle skippers. We have color pencils, crayons, goofy gooey. All right. Activity books, notepads, all kinds of little, look at this scented stickers i guess for s'mores that's kind of cool little little tiny erector sets basically activities oh look at these little squishy toys oh it's a hot dog oh oh boy oh no not a burger oh dude ew I'm not gonna do that what the heck do you think this is a chocolate chip pizza thing i guess it's supposed to be sausage i don't know moving on all right in the first aisle they have summer stuff oh i love the fact that they brought these back the solar flowers i used to have a bunch of these i mean they're so cheap but they they, they work for a year or two a couple of years i'd say anyway lots of easter basket fillers here's color pops here oh it's the um easter egg dyeing kits okay basket buddies and you can dress up a basket that look like a shark with bunny ears <laughs> notepads reusable modeling foam beads gift bags here's more bunny ears here they have tons of them i like these ones that one's cool but the shiny ones my aunt loves getting those even the rainbow ones i have lots of plates too cupcake uh cups there Food container. Oh, look at these Easter towels. I like that. I like that one. Not as big of a fan as the, of this one, but I like the other one. That's cool. The trays to put the eggs in once you dye them. A candy dish. Actually, that's kind of cool, too. One got carrots on it. Then on this side, they have a lot of Easter eggs. I mean, look at them all. We'll look at some of them real quick. Here's cupcake eggs. Those are glittery ones. Here's animal ones like tigers, and it looks like it looks like a monkey with a, a cow. It looks like a koala. That's very cool. Peeps, like the camo ones, have all different kinds. Look at the look at the aqua ones here. There's a starfish, a shark, a clownfish, a puffer fish, I guess. Here's Lego block eggs, those are cool. And you can actually connect them together too. They have little stuffed animals to put in uh, Easter baskets too. This green one is, I love the color on that. That's really cool. That one really pops a lot. Easter cookie decoration kit. That's cool. I guess it's like icing and sprinkles and stuff. And I love all the wall art they have here. They have a lot of wall art. Easter bunny stop here. I like that one. Happy Easter. Oh, I like that one. I think I might grab that one there. I like that. I have to grab a couple of things anyway, but I think that's going to be something I grab. Happy Easter. I like the big one. You got lots of window clings. 
And they have doormats here, too. I got an Easter one from a few years ago. These are all the same, though. Easter Egg Hunting Club. These are okay. I was wishing they'd have more to choose from, though. Everybody, welcome. Happy Easter. That's an alarm on my phone in the morning. <laughs> that sound. Welcome, Easter Egg Hunt. Happy Easter. I have something like this one at home. They have a lot. Not the biggest fan of Tinsel Garden Life. I say that all the time in every video I do. But that's true. I like this one too. Bunny Trail Farms Easter or Egg Hunts Daily. 25 cents a basket. That's cool too. Like it. Oh my gosh. Well, do I go through all these and try and find a treasure hunt? Or is it just going to be a waste of time? <sighs> I'm going to do it. Two hours later. Okay, so big waste of time which I'm not really surprised. What probably happened was one of two things. Either one, the guys that go to all the stores right as they open up at eight or nine o'clock come here, come here to the ones that get them and then resell them for three to four times the price. Or somebody that works here went through them before they even went up on the peg hook. So they, treasure hunts may never have even made it to the hooks here, so. Or someone just was lucky and got here and found them, so. But it's one of the two first things I bet. Not even, not even a super chase through the Matchbox cars. All right, let's go take a walk. Now that I'm disappointed after the Hot Wheels cars, I got a couple of ba uh, baskets that I needed to for, um, or pots that I got for my plants, and uh, a couple of Easter signs. Let's see what else? This is a really nice store in here. You wouldn't even be able to tell that this was a grocery store at one point. It looks like your everyday Dollar Tree. I'm sure they had to do extensive renovating on the inside, I'm sure. By the way, lots of cards here. Here's uh, Easter cards. Lots of Easter cards. They have a lot more on this side as well. Yep. Very good. Here's a look at the front of the store. There's people in that aisle, so we'll come back. Let's go through this one, though. Yeah, look at that. We can go right through here. All the office supplies in here. I need to get sponges, too. Oh, and I need a couple of photo frames as well. Hmm. Just can't remember what size I need. I can't remember if I need 4x6 or 5x7. Something tells me four by six. <laughs> I just can't remember. But they have so many here. Oh, I'll have to hit up one of my stores by my house. Might might be four by six. There's the one I have. Can't remember. I'll find out. Alright, back up this aisle. This is the aisle with the toys in it. All kinds of coloring books, activity books, and Regular books, arts and crafts on one side, fun and games on the other. <laughs> Let's take a walk through this aisle here. Air fresheners, cleaning supplies. Oh good, that's what I need, sponges. And here they are. Alrighty. I don't want the heavy duty ones, just the regular multi-purpose ones that don't scratch. Like those ones, something like that. Uh, yeah, I definitely don't want to be using Brillo pads. <laughs> These ones are good though, no scratch. These are like the ones I have, they're pretty good. So, whoop. get those, very good. Very good. There's a little look at the back of the store. Uh, we'll go up through this aisle here. What the heck, giving you the store tour of the old Surefine grocery store. <laughs> Very nice store. And I found the candy aisle. Food and snacks. Like I need any more. Oh, wait a minute. I know what I'm going to be looking for if I find them. <laughs> yeah. My weakness. 
my heart. They don't have them! No! <laughs> oh no, where are they at? They don't have my Swiss cake rolls. They have those body bars, which are just as good, but no. I might have to grab a pack of those. Do they have them anywhere else? Toasted oats? Toasted, no. Hmm, I got a lot of frozen food. A lot of frozen food. And some refrigerated stuff. Hmm. Can't just, oh, like, look at this. Like the, look at the summer stuff they put up already, too. <laughs> Seaside, surf and sand. Oh, that's cool. Yeah, it's like they just kind of needed space to throw stuff out, so they put the summer stuff all back here. Summer is a state of mind. It's my favorite time of year besides Christmas. I'm ready for summer. Especially after that tease I got going down the Folly Beach back at the beginning of March. Man, was that fun. That was a good time. Yeah, I really enjoyed myself there. But, let's see. Guess I have to settle for those uh, body bars. They're pretty good. If you can do peanut butter, they're pretty good. Hey. <laughs> yeah, let's get. Look at this little jar of Miracle Whip and the real mayo. Look how tiny they are. It's so adorable. Look at that. Look at the size of it compared to my hand. <laughs> and the little French is mustard. <laughs> that is too funny. It's the stupid little things like that in the Nutella right there, too, that are just, they're comical because of how tiny they are. <laughs> That's fun. And look at the little bear syrup, or uh, honey, anyway. Blend syrup. It's supposed to be honey in the, the dinner rolls. <laughs> they're so tiny, but that's what you get for $1.25. Whoop, good to go. Okay, so I'll go through this aisle last. I know I missed a couple, but there's a lot of people in here too. But anyway, go down the hardware aisle, the pet food aisle, electronics, you name it. All good stuff. Oh, they got some CDs down there. Don't see a lot of DVDs. They don't have a whole lot, but oh well, that was fun. That was a good time. That's a look at your new Oxford PA Dollar Tree. All right, well, that was fun. I know people have wanted me to do a Dollar Tree video for a while, and it's just, you know, with everything going on in my life this year, I just haven't had the desire to do one. But when I saw this coming up along US Route 30, I had to stop. I kind of forced myself a little bit, but I needed to stop in there anyway, and it was fun doing the video. It really was, so I really hope you enjoyed that, because I actually enjoyed doing this one, so... Yeah, I might be doing some more Dollar Tree videos here shortly. <laughs> I know there's one in South Carolina I want to check out there in uh, Columbia near Mary's Place. So I definitely wanted to see that one because that was an old grocery store as well, if I remember that right. I can't remember the name of it off the top of my head. Uh, I want to say an old Winn-Dixie. I can't remember what she said. But anyway, I want to check that one out. But I hope you enjoyed that. Got some goodies and some things I need. So, But anyway, I'm signing off. Thanks for watching, everybody. Take care. Stay awesome. Happy first day of spring, because this is when it's going up, the first day of spring. Yeah! Bye, everyone.